Hello all and welcome to this AWS tutorial. In our tutorial today, we will discuss about AWS S3 Glacier and learn how to list all active jobs and describe an active job. So until now, what we have covered so far is basically how to create a vault, how to upload an archive to a vault. We also initiated two jobs. One was to retrieve an archive. Uh, archive inventory and the other one was to retrieve an archive from a vault so we had at least have two jobs initiated now let's say if you have initiated additional jobs that's just perfectly fine so in our session today let's say if we want to know uh, how many jobs in total uh, are currently active on a particular vault Okay, then we can certainly have the entire list of all the active jobs, uh, you know, basically printed out for us. So the command to enlist all the all the active jobs that are currently in progress right now, and sometimes even you know, you'll see the job being listed once after it is completed as well for some amount of time. So if you want to see what are the various jobs that are running. Uh, for a specific world, then the command for that is AWS Glacier list hyphen jobs and then the account ID and the world name. So in this case, this is going to list all the active jobs for our world, uh, whose name is Nam World. So let us go ahead and copy this particular uh, command. Okay, so we are right here and let's copy this command. So control C and then let's go to our uh, CLI. So this is our CLI right here and I'm going to have this command copied right here. So as you see a command has been copied and once we hit enter, what this will typically do is it will basically spit out the entire uh, list of uh, active jobs as a JSON uh, output right here on the screen, okay? And unfortunately, what happens is that the screen kind of just scrolls and you cannot read anything much. So what I will do is once this command has been executed, I will copy the entire output in a notepad and then uh, we can certainly review the list of active jobs. Okay, so let me go ahead and execute this command and once I get the output, then we will review the output. So as you see, our command has executed successfully. And as you see over here, this is my CLI. And uh, it has just dumped the list of jobs that are currently active for my vault, NAM vault, okay? And what I have done, as I mentioned earlier as well, I've copied this entire output in a notepad. So let me quickly just go ahead and uh, clear my screen right here. And then we will go ahead and look at the output. I just wanted to show you that it is just going to come here as a complete dump and the window will just basically scroll on you. Okay, so let me go ahead and clear this. So there it is. And I'll go ahead and clear my drawings as well. So this is uh, the output that I have copied over here. So as you see, we have the job ID right there. And then we have the job description the action that was supposed to be taken, the archive ID, etc. cetera. Uh, then at the bottom over here, so this was our job basically to retrieve uh, 1.txt, okay? And this job right here, this is a job ID again, and the action was to retrieve the inventory for a particular board. Now ensure that you also uh, notice the status of the job. So the status code is right there. So it basically says that this job is currently in progress. I had already started this job almost, I think more than an hour or so back. But as you see, this is a very slow moving uh, service. It's not instantaneous. So it takes about at least a minimum of three to four hours. Even if it's a very small file, it really doesn't matter. It takes its own sweet little time to kind of complete the job. And similarly over here, even though we had just requested to, you know, get uh, the list of uh, archives or basically inventory retrieval, as you see, the status is currently still in progress. 
and hopefully it should be completed shortly okay so these are the two jobs that i have and ensure that you, i mean if you have your job ids that's great if not ensure that you kind of you know save this output somewhere because you have the job ids right here and then you can use this particular job id to basically check the status or describe the job as well okay so this was our output so let me switch back again to my command file right here so we listed all the active jobs for our world so the next thing that we will do is let's say you have a job um, id just like how we have a bunch of job ids with us and you want to uh, describe an active job you know you basically want to check its status etc so that is possible if you want to see what the job is doing what is the status where it stands so the command for that is basically describe job okay it's right here and what we need to do is you need to basically provide the account id the vault name and then at the end we need to provide the job id parameter so what we will do is from this output that we have right so i have this output right here i'm going to go ahead and copy this particular uh, job id so this is my job id right there I'm going to copy this and i'm going to paste it in my command okay so i'm going to copy it right here and then we will go ahead and execute this particular uh, statement that will describe this job so let us go ahead and copy this so i'm going to copy this and then we can go back to our cli and paste it here now again i will probably stop recording because it's going to take some time and then resume recording accordingly so let me go ahead and copy this right here so as you see our uh, command has executed successfully uh, you can actually see the job id uh, the action that it is supposed to take and the arn whether it's completed or not the status code and uh, basically the format so essentially let's say if you want to basically get a uh, get a status of a job or you basically want to know what a specific job does then you use uh, the describe job uh, command okay but if you let's say you just want to know all the list of jobs that are running for a specific uh, world then just go ahead and use the this jobs uh, function or the command okay guys so i hope uh, this was helpful as you see our job is still currently in progress i'm not sure when it's going to complete but whenever it completes after a few hours i will resume recording and we will hopefully have our inventory uh, retrieved and our file also retrieved and we will be able to see our retrieved archive so hopefully this job completes soon and then once it does i will resume recording okay take care and i will see you in some other video bye bye